Hi, this is RC Pop Pop. <clears throat> this is part two of the unboxing in Las Vegas. Enjoy. Project. So that's perfect little pissed off panda on the back. I like it. Oh, look at that. That one's going to be good too. The uh, 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 evolution of humanity. <laughs> I like that. Some California stickers. This is a nice little sticker thing. Thank you again, Panda Hobby, man. For I really, really really am impressed with the this so when people send me this i'm definitely gonna post it use it i i tried to get some from my local hobby store and they told me nye, nye. so that's why i'm i'm kind of mad at them i don't want to really promote them yet because they're kind of mean <laughs> and i always you know tell you support your hobby store and i try and i really do i don't try i do support my hobby store so let's get to the truck so here we go. Dun, 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 dun. Take off the back first. Oh man, this is a cool little truck. Wow, it's heavy too. Yeah, I can feel the de the, the weight difference. So, all right. So let's get here. I have the SCX 24, not the 10, and it's the Jeep. So you know, I wanted to show you that what's the difference in 118. I mean, yeah, in 118 compared to 124th, and this is the difference. So you can't see, but it's it's on this side, it's at least a, an inch shorter. So you have it this way, you can see it. Um, and then, so really, it's probably better if I hold it up this way, then you can see the difference of how much shorter it is. And then I'll do the wheelbase together. So look at that, the wheelbase is a lot shorter. A lot longer, a lot shorter. And the wheels, uh, comparable, almost the same size, the wheels. You know, look at the, can you see the wheels? Almost the same size. I think that the Jeep is just still a little bit, they might be identical. I'm gonna say they're identical size on tires. So, but man, I could definitely feel, and I have, uh, I have brass inserts on this truck, so it makes it a little bit more heavier, but I could definitely feel the difference in the weight. I think I might have a new favorite truck, man. This truck is pretty, pretty cool. <laughs> Let's get underneath it and look at Look at the bumper on it. Bumper is just like, and it's so militant looking, you know, you can see through the window, so you can put a little army dude in there, you know, oh, a butt face man or, or, or Hannibal Smith, you know, riding in there, that'd be sweet, man. Um, and then my stickers, the, the uh, evolution of humanity in the back, I'm telling you, man, this is going to be a bad little truck. <laughs> All right, so again, the pins, they're so tiny, you got to be careful with them. Don't lose them. Uh, I'm going to try, like I said, to convert these tiny little trucks into a magnetic uh, body mount. So uh, that's going to be a mod coming up, and we'll see how that works. I don't know, you know. I don't know really how it works. If it's better, if it's not. All right, so here we go. Da -da -da -da. There's the body. Look at that. Look at the wheel wells. Look at the, the, um, the side it's really detailed this little car this little truck the front grill look at that again i'm sorry for the lighting but uh this little body is detailed it's got the little wood slats in the back it's got a little step up here it's really you can see through the tiny little window oh man it's a cool little window so i'm really excited oh it's all gray underneath look at that sprayed all gray they really did a good job on this. I mean, for what did I pay for this? I think it was a um, hundred and nine dollars. Hundred, yeah, a hundred and nine dollars. And I seen it for a hundred dollars. This same truck. So it's. Uh, <clears throat> I don't know. I, I, I'm really. Uh, I can't wait to try it. Um, the tires are are really heavy. Oh my gosh! And and it's got the um, servo. The front servo is mounted. Look at that on the uh, axle itself. So you know that's a different different truck. So I'd like uh, I'd like to try it. See you know I mean look at the travel on that front end. It's really a lot of travel. I like it. So the articulation on it's going to be really wow. Look at that. 
twists, man. That's some good articulation on it. And so it comes with a 180 motor, 51 turn. It's, it's, I think it's a monster. I think it's big. So, and then look at the room. You could even add a bigger motor if you really wanted to. So, and then again, it doesn't, you know, have the traditional worm gear. It um, has the pumpkins. And uh, these shocks are, look at that. These are the only shocks that I've seen that are damped. They are awesome. Look at that. You push, you push down. Oh, can you see it? Let's see. You push down, and it comes up slowly. Man. So these are real shocks. I mean, if you can buy these shocks and mount them on the SCX25, the SCX24, that would be cool, man. Is uh, I didn't bring the other shocks. I mounted these shocks, but these shocks they're not they're not damped. These shocks, see? Oh, you can't see. If I if I bring you guys back, these shocks aren't damped, so they bounce. See? But these ones, they're damped. You, you, you push on them and they just come up nice and slow. Oh man, that's sweet. So, anyways. So the lights, when you mount them, you mount them here, here and here, the buckets I was showing you, and supposedly you can control the lights from here off and on. So that's pretty cool. Um, Again, I said the tires are weighted to 30 grams each, and the uh, SC, the SCX24 tires are only 11 grams. But I added, I cheated because I put inserts in here. What are they? Five gram inserts. So now they're uh, uh, 15, 16 grams tires on each one. Um, it's got a three-speed electronic speed controller all in one, you know, and then. You know, I guess it, it actually has a lot of more um, uh, ports for lights and accessories. You can put all kinds of stuff on this thing. So it really is, um, it really is, I think, going to be my new favorite truck. So I don't know. I'm going to have to check out the performance on it. <clears throat> I definitely like the look. I like the weightness. I like the color. I like that you can see through. I like that I could put a little a little Hannibal Smith in there. I think Hannibal, this is Hannibal's truck. I'm gonna put Hannibal in here because I bought him from 1983 A-Team, the little guys, and I'm putting him in here. Definitely gonna put him in here. And again, thank you for Panda Hobbies. I really, really like, really, really like the stickers. And I like, again, you'll be seeing a lot of this. I'm going to be sporting this uh, somewhere in the new studio that I'm building in my room with my dad's desk that I just finished and this in the garage and, you know, I'm going to start a collection. So, again, this is RC Pop Pop coming from Las Vegas. Thank you for watching. Be good humans. Do something good for someone you don't know. And don't forget, RC baby!